Yo, what up, though? It's your boy DME. I'm back, baby. Uh, this is my, I don't know when I uploaded this before or after. We're going to do three. Well, maybe we're not. Anyways, um, first of all, Big T has left NWX. He's left NWX. Um, a lot of speculation saying that he's been kicked out of NWX. It's only speculation. I don't know. Other people are just saying... That he just, is, you know, he ran his course. How do you get, why do? Why would you leave a group? Like, I, like, just out of the blue. So it makes me wonder, did he really get kicked out due to some bad performances recently? Um, he wasn't the, he was all right against Geechee. And he had that recent battle that just dropped on the app with, um, was it, was it Franchise? I haven't even watched it, to be real. I haven't watched it. I asked, I went on Twitter and I asked, should I watch this battle? And I got a resounding no from literally everybody. Not one person was like, yeah, man, watch the battle, it's fire. One person did say, uh, watch it, but fast forward, Big T's Bronx. So, you know, I, look, 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 I don't want to pile on Big T. You know, Big T's uh, done a lot for battle rap. He's, he's been one of them dudes back in the days. You know, he's been struggling as of late. Um, you know, he's had some issues with, with choking and stuff like that and just not looking comfortable up there. But he does have flashes, man. Big T's given us some fire, fire, uh, performances in the past, so I, you know, I hate to be that guy to be like, you know, pack them up, you know, we'll leave that to uh, my man Ben, but, um, you know, it, it, it's just, it's very, very interesting that he left NWX, it's just very interesting, you know, is NWX trying to clean up, are they like in this whole mindset that we only want people who are killers, who are going to be, who are representing the brand correctly, you know, they do got what, Don Marino now, I think they got Bankhead now, I don't even know, I don't know what's going on. You know, the whole group thing is trash to me anyways. I wish there, uh, if it was up to me, I, I would abolish all groups, but whatever. It's, it is what it is. Um, so, you know, I don't know. I don't know. It's an interesting, interesting uh, development. And it makes you wonder, like, how the world would have changed if Twerk had joined them uh, back, uh, what was it, last year? And then instead of, you know, bowing down to Jack Boy's 59-hour, uh, uh, um, you know, threat how things would have been now. New Jersey twerk. I know, I know, I know. It's not my, it's not my, I'm gonna say that every time. It's not my fault. It's not my fault when I bring up these bumps, all right? It's not my fault, all right? He just was on Twitter telling a female battle rap fan who criticized him about his battle against, uh, was it Jay Smooth, where he was, uh, you know, he was basically trash, bro. And um, she goes to him. All she said was to him was, um, I was disappointed in your performance. You know, blah, blah, blah. She, you know, and she's had nice things to say about Twerk in the past to a point where Twerk actually DM'd her and was like, you are, um, you're, so, I don't know what the, the cool the term is. Just something, you, you, you're, ah, just some weird old new, new age uh, uh, wording that these kids use these days. You're saucy. I don't know, something like that. You're, you're wavy. You're wavy. Maybe your was your wavy. Whatever. I'm old. Shut up. But anyways, uh, so she she tells him that, and you know what Twitch responses? SMD. Suck my SMD. These <laughs> between Ace Amin and, and Twerk, these are the the, the the Goonies might be the most the bit. The, the, not only are they the Golden Boys, because they definitely are the Golden Boys. They are the most sensitive battle rappers in battle rap bro all right you got you got a guy like twerk who does this all the time bro who just disrespects his fans remember what he did to sam all right what about the t-shirt about the sweater situation she buys sweaters from him or t-shirts he doesn't he doesn't he doesn't send them out she's trying to contact him and contact him and he's not responding finally responds and then he, he goes he goes you're a terrible person he basically cussed her out too all right now a fan a female fan tells him you know, oh, I was a little bit disappointed in your battle, man. You know, get it, to, you know, hopefully you get it together, you know. And it, so we, we expect, oh, SMD, SMD, SMD. Like, whoa, 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 whoa. can we cancel these? I, like, they're just, they're the worst. And they just get, they get, they get pass after pass after pass because y'all love Twerk's talent. And with Ace, they're, he's not getting passes because he doesn't have a fan base. So he's just continually going to get pushed because he's the golden boy, okay? But it's only gonna last so long, because when Emerson Kennedy, Emerson Ken Kennedy battles him, Emerson Kennedy, right, battles him. Remember when em Emerson, what literally uh, battled B Dot 
in the West Coast in front of an insane B dot. An insane B dot. And low key made that battle debatable, bro. Low key made that battle debatable. So what do you think he's gonna do with Ace Amin, bro? Like, come on, fam. I got I got Emerson all day, every day. Not just because I'm being a not just because I'm a I'm on my goonie I'm on my goonie hater trip, but it's not it ain't hate, it ain't hate, it's not my fault. But every single day these guys continue to just prove and show why they are trash, bro. They have no media. They don't know how to handle fans. They don't know how to handle media. They're completely lost, okay? They're disrespectful. And honestly, they're, they're a bunch of weirdos, bro. They're a bunch of weirdos. And it is what it is, man. Y'all can have them. Y'all can have them. I'm glad I'm not fans of them because I, I, don't, I wouldn't support people who lie, cheat, and steal and, uh, and, ha and, and, give, um, and don't come prepared. Okay, take spots that are deserving from other. You know what killed me? Uh, we're gonna talk about that list later. But the battle, the, the and I don't even like. This, who in 2020 cares what the Source magazine has to say? But they're putting out lists, the top 20 battlers of the year, we outlets of the year, and like there's so many people in their feelings and blah 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 blah. Like I said, who cares? But on the bottom of their list, and I don't care, but it's just hilarious how far the Golden Boy syndrome reaches. They put honorable mention Ace Amin on the top 20 battlers of the year. No Jerry West and no countless other battle rappers who have been putting in that work all year long, who have been choked, didn't get honorable mentions, but they put Ace Amin as an honorable mention. That's how you know the golden boy era is here. It's upon us. All right, it has its, its its claws in deep in the battle. It's, it's everywhere, bro. Even the Source magazine, okay? And the Source magazine went out their way to disrespect King of the Dot. So you know that this is a URL thing, all right? And don't, don't, don't sit here and tell me that the URL and Battle Rap Academy had nothing to do with the hacking on King of the Dot. I don't believe that for a second. Them little rats, you know they did it, all right? Allegedly, allegedly, I don't know, 100. But come on, man, I wasn't born yesterday. I wasn't born yesterday, little rats. Don't get me started with this, man. It's trash the way they be just... Makes me wanna throw up, it makes me wanna throw up. I'm glad I have no ties to them. I'm glad I have no ties to any of these leagues, man. And I can actually speak my mind because it's very rare in battle rap media where, where people don't have ties to these people and they can actually speak their mind 100. All right, without having to worry about getting that phone call. Because if I get that phone call, you know what I'm gonna do? And, you got a problem with what I said? And, who are you? I don't care, Smack. You don't, I don't, you don't owe me nothing, Smack. Shut up, Smack. <laughs> nah, that would, it wouldn't be Smack. It wouldn't be Smack. Smack's probably, you know, you know, I don't think he's a, I think he's just the face of the Illuminati. I don't think he's actually controlling it. I know who's controlling it. All right, love you guys. Let me know what y'all think.